几年哈，像你们这个过年都是不啊，都在穿护的时候，哎，把口罩戴好，注意防疫，听见没？ The COVID-19 outbreak in China is likely to play out in a more prolonged, more severe wave than previously, with approximately 36,000 deaths likely on January 26. According to a new projection that cited significant super spreader events due to the Lunar New Year holidays in the country. Earlier reports forecasted two waves for China with the number of deaths in a single day peaking at 25,000 but the calculus has since changed as festival travel appeared to have quickened the spread of the virus to several new provinces. 这一波的这个疫情啊，呃爆发的很猛啊，来的很快。广大的医务工作者一直在。防护疫情和日常治疗这两线作战，啊，长时间、高强度、超负荷的工作，为确保人民生命安全和身体健康，你们做出了重大的贡献，啊，大家辛苦了。Sharper COVID-19 waves mean a higher burden on healthcare facilities. China reopened its borders on January 8 after abruptly ending its zero covid policy of frequent testing, travel curbs and mass lockdowns the month before, prompted by unprecedented nationwide protests. The reopening has coincided with reports of hospitals and funeral homes being overwhelmed, even as air travel skyrocketed to reach volume 63% of 2019 levels. According to the latest revised projections, cases could peak at 4.8 million daily, with 62 million infections predicted between January 13 and 27. The people are suffering. People are so anxious, and uh, people are going to drugstores, the、um, uh, medical facility, the hospital, the clinics, tried as hard as they can to get what they need. The Lunar New Year festival began on January 7 when Chinese people returned to their hometowns to prepare for holiday that is set to start on January 21. The festival migration runs until February 15.